Inflammatory bowel disease is a spectrum of diseases uh, that includes what we call an ulcerative colitis and Crohn's disease. This is something that is completely different from irritable bowel syndrome or an IBS. Crohn's disease is a problem where it involves an inflammatory process of the entire intestinal tract starting from the mouth all the way down to the anus and more commonly we tend to see the last part of the small intestine and beginning part of the large intestine where the appendix is, is where the Crohn's disease problem starts. Uh, and apart from this, the second most common area is developing fistulas in the, in the anal area. So any patients who or anybody who has abdominal pains, loss of weight, loose stools along with uh, perennial fistulas, then Crohn's disease is something that definitely needs to be considered. Ulcerative colitis is a disease, as the name says, involves only the large intestine, only the colon and the rectum. The entire small intestine is, is spared from the disease. So these are completely two different types of diseases. These diseases warrant an immediate diagnosis. We make the diagnosis based on the colonoscopy. Uh, we definitely do a biopsy at the same time to look at underneath the microscope on what kind of disease it is. We do CT scans or MRI scans of the abdomen. Apart from that, there are some blood tests and stool tests that we do. These are all the things that collectively we put together and come up with the diagnosis of whether it is a Crohn's disease or ulcerative colitis. Once after the diagnosis is made, about 60 to 70 percent of the times medical treatment will take care of it. Only when there are complications from this, which is like a bleeding or a perforation or a complication of narrowing where the intestine is blocked off, that is when we as surgeons uh, come in into the picture. At Apollo Hospital Jubilee Hills, we have an excellent IBD clinic where we team up with the pathologist, the medical gastroenterologist and we as colorectal surgeons work together as a team in regards to medical treatment and surgical treatment of these patients. So you get a comprehensive evaluation and an excellent follow up on these patients. So if you have any signs of abdominal pain, bleeding per rectum or any anal fistulas, please do come and visit us to get a proper diagnosis and be able to get on a proper treatment modality. Thank you. Have a good day.